Are, are you playing playing a game? Tab plays that game too. Hey, oh, we're so live. I'm on long we're live. Hey, oh, hey, what's everybody. going on, everybody? We're live. Oh, no countdown, no <laughs> nothing. Live. Just spring it nope. on us. I just threw it out there. We are live with you special dummies. This, you unit. get to see this beautiful face now. Come on now. Hey, Fred, today, keep that keep that same energy throughout the whole show. <laughs> he won't. He'll get tired. It's be past his bedtime. His age will catch up. <laughs> Hey, hey. Welcome everybody to Special Dummy Unit. Hey, I, need ten, is... I need 10 likes. I'm over talking. Here. I need 10 likes over here. This hey. is episode 41. We're going to talk about food today. Yeah, any kind of food you want to talk about. Well, no, it. no, not that you want to talk about because if it's you, it's going to be burnt raw <laughs> noodles. No, it's going to be chicken and, and turkey. You don't eat no chitlins. I said chicken, you dummy. Oh, I thought you said chitlin. I was like, you don't even eat chitlin. Chitlin loaf. Oh, Lord. I think that's that's chicken loaf, Fred. <laughs> chicken loaf. <laughs> chicken yeah, we, loaf. Got, we got our snacks ready. All sorts of good stuff. Yeah, David's got... I bought David the smushed up one. So. I brought my own that you don't even have, so bite me. Oh, you got a uh, breakfast pizza? Oh, you got pizza. Pizza. oh, wait, hold on. Hold on. Uh, it's a food episode, right? I've already eaten. God, I'm stuffed. God, dude, me too. We had tacos. <laughs> I haven't ate yet because I forgot. Normal tacos and pork tacos. Ah. Pork tacos? Yeah. Oh. Put a pork loin in the pressure cooker and let it oh. slow cook. Oh, heck Never yeah, heard. dude. So, like, that. real quick, like, uh, like it was but like four or five years ago. That I realized that walking tacos were a thing. Yeah. I didn't know tacos could walk. <laughs> nah, dude. <laughs> the, the cans are in my hand. Uh-uh. <laughs> or it's in my stomach. Now you just get you just make all the taco stuff like like white people taco night. And then you get like <laughs> bags of Doritos yeah. and you just pour like it all over the table. pour it all. Yeah, pour it all oh no, no, no. No, 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 not that white people taco night. I'm talking about regular, <laughs> regular white people taco night. <laughs> Oh Lord! It's There's funny white people. when There's I say in the white, comments, guys. What's wrong? When I say white, when I say white people taco, taco night, yeah. When I say white people taco night, everybody knows exactly what I mean. <laughs> I like, have no clue ta- what you're what? saying. You don't know what I mean? Okay, like so you get like the taco meat, like the the hamburger, and you like put the taco seasoning in it. And then you like cut up the tomatoes and you put it in a bowl and you cut up the yeah, onions. It's, put it it's in the easy bowl. to do for the employees at work. Like <laughs> right? that way, you can just walk around, grab a bag, go eat, and then go back to work. Oh, I yeah, love how I said that. He just went into fully I mean, explaining well, to me. That's the what thing. Like <laughs> for those that don't know what white people taco night is, like hey, hey, that hey, that, that no, white people tacos, not white. That's <laughs> hey, that gives me an idea. Like, if we ever have tacos again, I'm just going to have a bag, and I'm just going to eat my taco out of a bag. He, got, he you know, like we you, don't ever like, eat oh, like, if you get a bag of, like, if you get a bag of Doritos, and you open them up, and then you pour the stuff inside, that's a walking taco. Yeah, but Fred was talking about a bag, but he needs one like, straps to his head, like a feed oh, bag. Yeah, like a, like a feed like, bag. <laughs> 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 Debbie, if you want to oh. know what we're talking about, you got to show up on time, okay? At 8.15. I clearly put the time on there. Debbie, you good. Don't what? Even... Oh, my Lord. <laughs> One of our faithful viewers. I don't even know what page she's watching off of. We, we, my we stuff's talking all about, geared we're up. We're talking about tacos. Yeah, we're talking about... This is the Special Dummies Unit, uh, episode 41. We might talk about food. <laughs> We oh, might, we're, but we we're, get all right. we're starting it pretty good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We just started off right. Well, now y'all got so, uh, food. I'm hungry. So our our mater our mater D tonight for the uh, for the ex- extent of our show. Um, David, what? you wanna do you wanna tell us who our mater D for tonight's? <laughs> For tonight's show is oh, well, me. <laughs> oh. <It's food. sighs> oh, I was. So oh boy! Oh. If you want, we're gonna talk about food and Roland does food stuff. So I do food hey. stuff. Wow, David! I was cooking for a long time. 
four hundred dollars, man. I know, I know how that feels. Debbie spent four hundred dollars on grocery shopping. So what did you get? Like a half a, a, roll, of ham, a roll of hamburger meat <laughs> and a loaf of bread. <laughs> Dude, Bidenomics got you getting a, a half, one sleeve, one half a sleeve of crackers, yeah, nah, and some uh, nah. and some potted she, meat. She got the she got the full sleeve, boy. She, she went with the cheap crackers. <laughs> four four hundred dollars gets you a half a sleeve of crackers and some potted meat. Are, are they the club crackers? No, they're not even the club crackers. You get those little oyster. You get those little oyster crackers. <laughs> those aren't even crackers. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Oh, oh, she's oh, already started. Oh, look, I told you. I look, I told you guys we were gonna fight about this. <laughs> no, pineapple goes on pizza. Yeah, it does. Only specific kinds of pizza, like yeah, you, you know, can't like just you can't just barbecue. You, you, know, you can't just yeah. really, you can't just willy nilly it. Like, oh, I got a, I got a supreme pizza here. Let me throw some pineapples oh, on there. Sardines, <laughs> oh, oh, pineapples. <laughs> Sardine. Oh, dude, I used to, I used to, I used to veer as far away from sardines on pizza as I possibly could. I lived in Alaska, and I just happened to be at a place that had sardines on pizza. So I good. love, I love that quick little humble brag right there. I lived in Alaska. <laughs> <laughs> we haven't all, we haven't all lived in Alaska. No. Oh, my wife actually has family in Alaska. Do what? My wife actually has family in Alaska. Oh, dude, like, so don't is, don't like, talk don't yeah. talk about a don't talk about a humble brag. I was stabbed in the back and my razor my razor blades were razor blades my uh, roller blades were taken from me. <laughs> razor blades, not razor blades. I was stabbed in the back with a screwdriver and my freaking uh, they tried to steal my roller blades. What the so hell? yeah, not not the best. I lived in a I lived in a. Uh, I lived in a neighborhood. Yo, uh, we're gangster, yo. We I, li I lived in, in a. Alaska. I lived in a neighborhood in a, in Anchorage uh, that was right outside the Air Force Base. So it was. Uh, it was a neighborhood, is all I'll say. <laughs> Debbie, uh, you're not going to win this argument. <laughs> not going to happen. Yeah, you're going to lose. Every, Sorry. Everybody is entitled to their own opinion, even if they're except wrong. for. <laughs> exactly. Oh. Now, 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 going going with the pineapple thing, I will say I like the taste of it. Hey, what's I going on, Sam? I can't, I can't eat it at all. It will make me sick every time. I don't know hey. why. It, it's hot pineapple for some reason that will make me sick. Well, Debbie, I mean, then you must not put uh, tomato paste on your pizza either. Yeah, because yep. tomato, tomato is a fruit. Is a, is a fruit. Ooh, logic. We win. Air five. Ugh. That was so white. What? I was so lost on what y'all Fred's sitting over there going, y'all some dumbass. And it's coming from Fred. <laughs> anyway, roll. All right, sure. Let's start off with um, uh, ha Haggis. I honestly don't even know what the hell haggis is. Oh, it's right, so, great. No. What? No, it's not great. Don't you know it's like a it's like a hot dog. You don't think about what's in it. You just enjoy Dude, it. But let me explain to you what's in it. So it's sheep's heart, oh. liver, lungs, minced with onions and oats, and cooked inside an animal stomach. Hell yeah. It's I like have a sausage. Never had it, and I don't think I ever will. After but it's larger than a. It's remember. larger. Oh than yeah, a it's so much bigger. Like so, you're, you're not gonna bread that. Like okay, so so if you, uh, I've actually seen it breaded before. Uh, so it, if goes, if, you, if if you if you if you are if you are talking about the disgustingness of haggis, uh, I won't even go into what's inside of a hot dog. Yeah, well, I mean, it's the same thing. Like, right, I don't right. want to know it's what's in a hot dog. Put together differently. And it's put together differently, and it's not so large. Like, you're not like. No, eating... it's like it's like meat pies. You just you just cut it and eat it in slices. It's delicious. <laughs> you don't even you don't even really like if you don't think about it. You you don't even you don't even think about it, and it's delicious. You should give it a try. Uh, it's been a while since I had any of that. Any haggis? haggis? It's been a while since you've had no, haggis. Not, uh, yeah, back when you were in the old country I'm in Scotland, the Highlands, right? I'm talking about meat pie. 
Oh, meat pies are delicious. Meat pies yeah. are great. Uh, yeah, yes, I mean, Debbie. I mean, technically, tomatoes are fruits. Are I fruits? Yeah. Out where to get them at? Uh, we ain't I, I knew a dude, I knew a gas station that that made some fire meat pies. <laughs> All right, Sam. Yeah, I did hear that, but we're talking about food tonight. This ain't always about wrestling around here. I didn't we're notice. I didn't usually get into it. But. The last <laughs> box, the last box set I I officially bought was the CM Punk box set. Oh, mine was The Rock. Hey, it's you... whatever I found hey, at a yard wait, sale. Hold on. Right. Wait, well, look. Okay. Did now you, I know. I know. I sound. The rock? Didn't you give me that Rock DVD? I know. I sound. Yeah, I did. That full set. Yes. Yeah. I know. I, I know. I sound all hoity-toity when I say officially <laughs> bought. 90% of my wrestling DVDs I bought at flea markets and yard sales. But the, the CM Punk one is the one that I actually went to the store and purchased it um, Purchased it officially. Uh, all right, let's get back on eating this weird haggis crap. Because that just sounds horrible. What would be super horrible. cool is if one day we did one of these and we were officially like together but separate. And we all had a plate of haggis in front of us, or a plate of whatever. That you know, I'll go with that one. It was almost like a like a taste test. No, no, no. What? Well, I mean, I, you're just afraid to try new things, David. No, number one, number one. <laughs> how soft is it? Because I ain't got no damn teeth. It's uh, number two. That's gross. Just don't think about it. I don't have to think about it. I have eyes. Even no, you don't. It's my, not. It's my not. On, I can it's see not that garbage. It's not like it's not like you cut it open and there's like you, chunks of heart and lungs and and yes, innards in there. It's all minced. In it. It's all minced up. It's all mixed up care. like pureed. <sighs> <sighs> oh. Look, look at his, up, bro. Look at his, I look at his dumb food. <laughs> Look at his face. Look at his face. All right, what, 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 what did we have uh, the other day? Uh, chili, beans or without beans? Oh, I'm going to have beans. beans. Yeah, beans. Easy. Yeah, beans. Easy. I got to have beans. some gas for the tank. <laughs> but now, if I'm not mistaken, in the, the Western times, they didn't, they didn't have beans out on the range, did they? It was just hamburger. It was just meat. Oh, no, I think beans was like a staple. Like, you remember that movie, uh, A Thousand Ways to Die in the West, and everybody's farting all the time? It's because of the beans. Well, then they, didn't, then they didn't have meat in the West. One of the ingredients wasn't there. The hold, on. hold on, Debbie. You can't discuss, be involved in this discussion. Go put some freaking noodles in your chili, like you said. You, you'll go eat your chili, Mac. <laughs> We're playing. We're just playing. No, I figure. I figure it was uh, back in the old days. It was the 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 meat side of it, uh, some in some form uh, that they had issues with. <laughs> Sam, what is this? What is this about? What's going on here? Let's break this one down. <laughs> you can always. You can also eat always safe spaghetti rings straight from the can in a Dodge Neon in an Arby's parking lot. Is that what? Yeah. Sam, come is that, up with the weirdest stuff. Is that because I was talking about Bidenomics and only being able to afford a half a sleeve of of crackers and hey, potted if, meat if that's, on four hundred dollars? If that's the case, though, those spaghetti rings are actually most of the time are actually it costs a little bit more than the regular. Yeah, yeah. Spaghetti. Oh yeah, dude. Like some of those some of those all, always safe products are more expensive than the just the name brand stuff. So isn't yeah, it back, weird? Isn't so it weird how some of those taste better? Than the name brand stuff. Oh yeah, Sorry. that's for sure. So yeah, back in the day, the main thing was black bean, pinto beans, and tomatoes. Was for chili out on the range. So they must have had like a so that so that uh what was that thing called the 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 chuck wagon? That son of a bitch must have had like some special seasonings and sauces on there. Either that or you just dump like a half a you just dump like a half a thing of hot sauce in it and then boom chili. <laughs> huh. Back then you back then you ate everything with cornbread, so like chili and cornbread. 
Uh, I beans, still do beans, that. Cornbread, yeah. We, had, well, we actually had a chili cook off at our work not too long ago, and there was a lot of people brought cornbread as well. I had never really thought about cornbread and chili. I always like it's not up it's not bad. Yeah, or crushed oh, up crackers. Uh, I mean, like for the past, like well, I mean, like ever since I can remember, like it being married, we we always use like Frito, like the Fritos, because we put we put sour cream in our chili. Yeah. Yeah, I put sour cream on too. But they can do sour cream. Yeah, he'd say, look at him. Look at, look at, that, look at that put him. His face. Yeah. Y'all are gross. The Fritos, yeah. Sour cream, throw it in the trash. Don't ever buy it. Don't waste <laughs> it. <laughs> you know what? I, I just, Hamburger Helper, Helper truthfully does not touch my house. Why? Dude, I grew up with it so oh, much. Okay. Being a right, dork, right. Look, like I can't do this, it. This, this right here, what you're <laughs> saying right now, that is exactly right. Uh, I'm not, I'm not talking shit about the way I was raised, but when I was growing up, it was hamburger helper. It was a lot of nights of beans and potatoes, uh, you know, beans, fried potatoes, and 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 cornbread. And bologna. <laughs> uh, oh, sometimes, yeah. sometimes hey, bologna. We uh. We didn't. I didn't have to deal with it a whole lot growing up because you know, you know, we we hunted, we fished, we had a big ass garden and all that stuff. So we did raise the majority of our own food. But when I was married the first time, uh, you know, we had. I walked into you know having zero kids to three kids overnight, and things were financially right. strained. So we survived their hamburger helper. So now. No, don't get me it's wrong. Just, okay. Yeah, if everybody's watching, you're like, oh, look, that's not, that's no, not what like, we're saying. <laughs> so, so now, Hamburger Helper, they've got so many different items. When I was a kid, yeah, it was like, now. it was like um, the packet, the noodles, meat. That was it. Right, right, right. And you got to add your own seasoning. Some meat. Yeah. You got it right. <laughs> but you know, I was, like, like, I was dude, poor enough where I was like doing like, my parents would buy like spaghetti. And uh, just like the the Hunt's tomato in a can, dude. It's just like pour it in yes. there. Um, is that no meat. Dude, no. I just since this is the food episode, I'm gonna. Okay, so like growing up, I was a huge Ninja Turtle fan. Still am. Um, <clears throat> I had begged my mom and dad for a whole year, and I had told all of my friends for a whole year. We were having a Ninja Turtles pizza birthday party for my birthday. <clears throat> so, I, I'm, dude, I am hyped. I get up that morning. I'm thinking, hell to the yeah, Ninja Turtles. This was like 87, 88, maybe 89 or early 90. Um, I know that's, a, that's a long span. I, mean, I know, I know, I know. Uh, it, it, I was a kid. Ninja Turtles was big. It was probably like 89 or 90. <clears throat> So I told all my friends, we're having a Ninja Turtles birthday. I'm having pizza. Man, like, it's going to be it's gonna be killer. Cowabunga. You know what I'm saying? So the day goes by. I'm having a good time. I'm outside, and I'm smelling pizza. So I'm thinking, oh, yeah, they came through, and they actually got pizza. <clears throat> I run into the house. I run into the kitchen. My mom's in the kitchen. And she opens up the stove, and I'm thinking, okay, maybe she cooked them instead of buying them, which is super cool. Homemade pizza is the bomb. So she pulls out this this um, oven tray, this tray, this baking tray, and it was lasagna. <laughs> <laughs> no, guys, listen. He's fucking scarred, okay? Like, he's... <laughs> That's no, that's no, that's no freaking joke. I, I legit am scarred. So whenever I smell pizza, like I have to, I have to double, I have to double check and make sure that it's actually pizza and not lasagna, because I will lose my shit. That was the worst, dude. That your wife's the, not near you, is she? Yeah, she's right beside me. Does she know the oh. story? Because now she's totally she does, honey she pizza. Know. Right, right, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, she she not she understands those scars are deep, and I don't think that she would ever do that to me. <laughs> that one, you're like, I feel your pain. 
Now, See, now she that, would that's actually. The, that's the difference between us and her. I'm, I right. do that shit on purpose. Right, right. No, like this is this is how this is how good she is to me. Um, so when she makes lasagna, she makes sure to tell me it's lasagna. Like, like before I even walk in the house, she's like, Hey, I'm making dinner. We're having lasagna. And I'm like, okay, I won't walk in the house and think pizza. Does your wife make homemade lasagna? Do what? Does your wife make homemade lasagna? Yes. Cottage cheese or no cottage cheese? Cottage cheese all the way. Yeah. So I, don't I, don't like, like it. I don't like cottage cheese, but I'm, I'm cool with it in, in lasagna. I mean, that's a different demon there. Oh, dude, when I was a kid, I used to hate cottage cheese. But when I, like, the second I turned 18 and joined the Marine Corps, like, cottage cheese was, like, the best. I don't know why I didn't say this a second ago, but I can just see Bruce walking in his house and his wife's like, we made lasagna, and all of a sudden he starts having fucking flashbacks and going off and hiding behind the couch and shit. Laying, laying, in, the floor my, in, the, my laying in the floor in the fetal position. Oh, I just wanted pizza. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no, it's, it's fine, dude. It's, it's like you said, Roland, it, it's a legit, it's a legit, like, I'm scarred, bro. Yeah. Like nobody pulls that out like that without, yeah, I felt it. Like, <laughs> Look, you know, you know, you know how it is. You know how it is when you're a kid and your birthday's coming up. You're inviting all your friends. You're gonna, you know, like, you're gonna get to see all the Ninja Turtles and cool like stuff that you're gonna get. And because you oh, know, yeah. and, and, were... and you tell them, you tell them, I'm having pizza. I want you, you, you can have as many slices as you want. Uh, you only eat like three or four. Like me, I'm the birthday boy. I'm gonna get the pizza first, and I'll pass it out like Leonardo in the Ninja Turtles movie. And uh, then it's lasagna. I can't relate because I didn't really have any birthday parties. Oh, mom, if you're, mom, say mom, mom like, if you're watching, we're having, a, we're having a birthday party, and it's like my aunt and uncle show up. That's it. Damn, dude, we're all getting deep into like some like stuff because I'm about to go to. So when I was a kid, and uh, we lived in California, I don't know if you remember this. That's when the Ninja Turtle, <laughs> when the Turtles, um, uh, was in concert, they had a concert. Remember that? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, we're coming, gonna... coming out of your shell concert. Yeah, I want to go to that so bad. Here we go, right? And then we yeah. got there, and they were sold out. Oh man. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Dude, hey. So a couple of years ago, my dad cooked eggs in the microwave, and I threw up in front of the girl playing doctor at daycare. I didn't eat eggs for over twenty five years. Oh wow, that sucks. Uh, so wait a second. Uh, like, what kind of eggs? Like scrambled eggs? You can yeah, put scrambled eggs. If you, you can yeah, put scrambled eggs in the microwave. You can put eggs in not the, the same though. You could even. Did you say poach? You can poach them in there too. Uh, again, it's just not the same though. Oh, no, so no, it's just no, egg. And the smell. About, if they do stink. Yeah. How about the century egg? Have you heard of that? The century, cinch. Oh, dude, no. Yeah. Are you talking about like balut? The like the black egg? Yes. It, so oh, I, I really, it, it, it's processed in clay, ash, and quicklime. Oh, perfect. So what exactly is it though? Oh, dude, it's like a it's like a rotten egg, like ten year old egg. Yeah, it's it's, it's a century. It's some some bitch is black. No, I've seen it before. I just didn't know what it what it actually was. And because of everything that it's uh, processed with, it's fucking edible. It's weird. Oh uh, yeah, I've, I've dude, I've watched I watched a couple of like review videos on people eating it. I, I follow a couple of foodies on on YouTube, and oh my gosh, like <laughs> I watched a video of a dude eating eating balut in his car. <laughs> oh. Oh, so bad. Not was like, that, not, was it that not like Brandon, Andrew. was it that Brandon Ferris kid? I, I not, like Brian. No, it wasn't him. Uh, oh, I can't okay. remember who he's the hell hilarious it was, but when he does stuff like that. Uh, is that the same dude that ate the tarantula? Yeah. And okay. Freaked out, so oh, yeah. Fre- <laughs> dude, I think it was dead and dude freaked out. Oh, since you brought that up, like my mouth is like. I got a foot round. 
I haven't even ever ate one of those, and I can just imagine like biting into it, and the yolk like turns into like a turns into like a slime. So anyway, oh, oh. Bruce, come back! Hey, you're back. <laughs> I just wanted Fred to be on top of you. Oh, that's fine. Everybody wants to see Fred on top of me. In bed with Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> Oh Lord! Come on, Fred. You got some weird food. What's up? You're up. You're up. Oh, he got a mouthful. A mouthful. <laughs> a weird food thing. Oh, oh. Boy, it got quiet all of a sudden. Oh, Our beer. Yeah, it quiet. did. All right, what Wait, about pickles? Yeah. Okay, like pickles, uh, bread and butter pickles all the way. I can do bread and butter pickles. I'm glad. Well, you're like the only person that's in agreement with me ever on that. <laughs> oh, dude, uh, oh, I, I love, it. I I love going to like I like Sonic does it a lot. They'll surprise you with the bread and butter pickles on a burger. I, I, I usually do dill pickles up? because it it overpowers everything. Oh, dude, okay. yeah. So I like use sweet pickles. That's what I'm saying. Like that's the bread and butter pickles. Are the sweet, the sweet, uh, sweet pickles? Oh, so good. Uh, dude, I didn't like, eat any kind was, of pickle, really. It's just nah, weird. It's that just sounds weird. bad when I say it like that because all I can think of is you, know. you can eat my pickle. It's wow. Just weird. It's just weird that it's a kosher. When we go to a <laughs> yes. restaurant, they, I get pickles, and then half the time I don't. And I don't like those pickles. I like the other one. Uh, so, you, so, you just, are, so you just get the wrong ones? Bad. Yeah. Yeah. That's, and then. Uh, How does that work? Like, that's like onions. It's just that's ice like, cream. That's like <laughs> yeah, that's onions. it. Onions. <laughs> like, I. Fuck your brownie, Sam. Onions. Not unless they cook in. You like, you like, so you don't like raw onion? No. I don't either. No. Oh, you I can are... do it. I can do raw onion on chili. Cheese dogs. Oh yeah, and a burger. But like most, I like. Them, like, I, like uh, I like the uh, like the onions that. I know it's gonna sound weird, but the onions <laughs> that you get, the onions that you get at the grocery store that have the stalk still on them, you can grow those in your yard. So you and eat raw onions from time to yeah, time. Yeah, I already I, knew that. I, I eat, smell you. I eat raw garlic like, too. <sighs> Keeps the vampires I like, away. I like garlic. Hold on, hold on, hold on, Plus, hold on, hold on. Sam, that's just chocolate ice cream, man. Yeah, dude, it's just... Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> At this point, you must have not called a brownie oh. blast. Yeah, Sonic. Oh. Yeah, Sonic. Oh. yeah, Sonic just robbed you. Yeah, Sonic just... Oh, David just, God. David just, David just killed himself. Uh, not, not, literally, not literally. It was, he just uh, gassed himself out. Got <laughs> Need a gunshot. <laughs> <laughs> wow. It's a backfire. Oh. It's like the old. It's like the old car. You give it a little gas, and it backfires. That's what Fred sounds like when he farts. It's like his butt cheeks are giving him a round of applause. <laughs> All right, Bruce. You only get yeah. one one food. Your favorite food. What is it? Favorite food. Uh, one, uh, yeah. one item. Oh, Wait, one item. Mm -hmm. Yeah, something you can eat over and over and over and over. That's just about everything. But I'll I'll say tacos. I'm uh I'm the I'm the only guy that I know of in my hometown that uh went to the Taco Bell when it was part of KFC when it first became part of KFC and asked them to sell me a bucket of tacos. <laughs> they were like they were like how are we going to do that and I'm like I don't know just figure it out like you usually put like you usually put like 12 pieces of chicken in a bucket Put me like twelve tacos in a bucket. Just write it up as bucket o tacos and give it to me. Bucket <laughs> o tacos. Everything's gonna have an o in it, man. Don't right? Me, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. I'm gonna say I'm gonna say tacos. I could eat those. I could eat those all day, every day. Uh, Fred, go ahead. Uh, that's it. Oh man. In little, in little be, babies. In Fred little babies be ramen first, noodles. Bro. No, not Roman noodles. No. Roman noodles? 
if I, Roman, if I have, where, where are they I going? Have, if I have to pick, man, this is going to be torture. Doo, doo. Oh, man. Doo, doo, doo. I'm going to just say pizza, even though, oh, man, I can eat the other thing uh, anytime, too. But I'm going to say pizza. The other thing? Uh, chicken. I was talking about chicken. Oh, chicken? Yeah, he didn't want to go act like he was all racist and stuff. Uh, then... I like my ch- I like my chicken fried. <laughs> oh, you like oh fried? Oh man, yeah. I mean, yeah, some greasy fried chicken. Get your fingers all glossy. Oh, uh, yeah. Well, yeah, I like fr- fried. Fingers looking good. Fried right. Is pretty good. Bake is good. Bake but is you good. only get one, Fred. I, I say pizza. Okay, pizza. He said pizza, but then went off on a tangent. You know, he, right, right. I think Bruce, are you sure that ADHD is not contagious? <laughs> no, no. It's well. I mean, it could be. <laughs> if you think about it, it uh, seems it seems to be more and more. It's rubbing off on everybody. Okay, okay, right, da- right. okay, David, your turn. <laughs> <laughs> Roman coming to the ring. Roman noodles. <laughs> this is not a big box. <laughs> uh, in all, in all honesty, probably, I really don't think I have a favorite food. But if it's something I could eat over and over pretty easily, because when I make it, I make enough to last a week and a half, probably. So it's spaghetti. Yeah. Especially if it's you know the spaghetti, spaghetti sauce, and cheese, like. A bunch of cheese in it, cheese right, and right, yeah. right. I can eat all day long. Every you day. put you put zucchini in your chili or your spaghetti? <laughs> zucchini? No, I'm no, I really don't keep zucchini around. You know, um, I get I I'll get some every once in a while. And I'll fry it, but I, I really don't use it in other stuff. So back a hundred years ago, when me and the wife first got married, <laughs> she made spaghetti, and like the spaghetti that. The spaghetti sauce that that you got at the store, she got the chunky style prego, and that stuff had legit chunks like this big of zucchini and like like not Hello, like little dude. little chopped up bits of like carrots and stuff. Huh. It was like yeah. chunky <clears throat> sauce. It was like chunky uh, spaghetti sauce. Now, uh, when you go and get the same kind. Like the the portions of the zucchini are like so small you can't even see them. It's, now, it's, now, if it's, it's horrendous. If it's already if it's already in that sauce mix or something like that, yeah. But I don't I don't cut up. All yeah, yeah. Them. You don't go out of your way to. Now to now what I there. do is though like if you do like the the prego jars or whatever, uh, you know it's supposed to be one jar to what one pound or something like that or maybe more. But I'm gonna do like one jar to like five pounds of meat, you know. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, yeah, we yeah. do we do, we do a meat sauce too, but it's got zucchini and mushrooms. Oh yeah, uh, in it, and so you can't see, we, you we can't, can't skip do mushrooms. So. Oh yeah, somebody's if somebody's allergic to right. it. Not she's not necessarily allergic to it. I mean, she she is somewhat allergic to them, but it, they also make her sick. Like outside of just an allergy, you know. And oh, you know so what's she under- wouldn't. Go ahead. You know what's under? You know what's underrated? What's that? Sun dried tomatoes. Yes. I'm not a big <clears throat> tomato person. Yeah. Like I'm not a. I'm a really weird. Like I don't like chocolate stuff, and I don't like like cheese dip. But when the wife makes oh, cheese dip, oh, oh, listen oh. to me. Listen to me now. Okay, like Rotel, Rotel. I'm not a super huge fan of Rotel. That's just me. Um, preferences and whatnot. I don't um, like Rotel. So one time, uh, me and the wife, well, I made a mistake of, uh, I'm number one. Yay. <laughs> so I made a mistake. The wife sent me to the store to get Rotel stuff. So I got the cheese and I got the, I got the, the, the cream of mushroom. And I got the, I got, I got one can of the, the, uh, the Rotel mix with the, the peppers and the, the tomatoes and everything. Yeah. And then I accidentally got one can of the, the diced tomatoes and onions. They look similar, but they're one's called Rotel and the or Rotel so mix. The and the other one is like, no, 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 no. It's, it's the same brand, but it's, oh. it's a, it's a completely different uh, ingredient. Like yeah. it has, it has, it has to, whoa. Really? Did you, just, did you just pour that all over your computer? <laughs> well, looks like it looks like Roland shows violence tonight, y'all. 
There was nothing in it, dude. And then there was some in it. <laughs> So anyway, I made the mistake of got, getting the uh, the tomato, basil, and onions mix. And when I got home, it was actually really good. When I got home, oh, like, cool. the wife was like, you made a mistake. And I'm like, eh, just try it. And she put it all together, and it, it was actually really good. Uh, the Rotel was less less spicy, and uh, the tomato, basil made it, made it kind of – What's the point uh, of Rotel if it ain't going to be spicy? Give me the chili fixing. Rotel <laughs> and the hot Rotel. It ain't even no, hot, dude. I can't. Uh, I've got. Yeah, I've got real bad. I, I've got real bad IBS. Good. I've got real bad IBS. Uh, uh, you you would you would remember that from uh, Sunday. Just when deal we with ate, it. When we ate at IHOP. <clears throat> Oh yeah, this so, motherfucker took like twelve shit. <clears throat> so 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 Sunday, me and David were were booked at a wrestling show in Cersei together because we're tag partners, and uh, we ate it. We we met at IHOP. <clears throat> I got the I got the the biscuits and gravy thing no, that came with it. You got there late because you had to stop on the way there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so had to stop in Bald Knob to go to the bathroom. Then when we got there, like I ordered the biscuits and gravy meal that came with the eggs and the sausage and the the hash browns. Anyway, so I mixed up my I got scrambled eggs because I'm a I'm a kid. So I got scrambled eggs and I mixed them all up I with the cheese, eggs. some cheese. And uh, I took the Tabasco sauce and I like just like poured it on there. And then I was eyeballing David, like hoping that he would look at me. I got the pepper and I was just like peppering the shit out of my my plate. I wasn't even hitting like all the things that I was trying to hit. I was just peppering it. And Tabs in there watching him pepper the table. Dude, I had yeah, dude. Like I'm talking like there was pepper all over the damn place. I'm in <clears throat> I'm in my own world eating my own food. Yeah, so uh, when I got done, like, I was good. We we went to Walmart, then we went to the show, and, like, the second we got to the show, I was like, oh, I got that rumbly in my tumbly, and I had to go. That hot Hold sauce. On. You you didn't – we didn't get out of IHOP before you disappeared. No, and yeah, you're right. Walmart, you're right. You disappeared. Right, right. Uh, look, so my IBS is so bad that I can even, like, I'm talking about spicy food right now and I feel like I have to go to the bathroom. I think I know bathroom in Bald Knob. I, so I stopped at a bathroom in Bald Knob. Yeehaw. Yeah. It's so bad. I mean, I know. <laughs> the, I sun, know the sun goes down I in the bathroom sound, in Bald Knob. I know it sounds weird. <laughs> I know it sounds weird, but yeah, what's up? There's, certain, there's certain bathrooms that I will use and certain bathrooms I won't use when we are waiting. Like from the, the men's? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I love you, man. Sorry, Fred. I had to. No, oh, no, no, like, I, I, know, I know a lot of. I, it's it's cool. I know a lot of people that can only use their own bathroom, or they can yeah. only use certain bathrooms. Uh, with IBS, uh, all bathrooms are a bathroom you can use. Yeah, you I don't have care. A choice. I, I don't care if it's. I don't care if it is the. I don't care if it is an outhouse behind the Texas Chainsaw Massacre <laughs> gas station. You're gonna use it. I don't care. I don't care if you bust into the. Oh. Hey, you, you see these right here. They make they make re they make really good one of these that have vodka in them. They uh the Dollar General has French vanilla cordial. Oh wow! Juice David said that the Juice David said that the Dollar Store has French vanilla Queen Anne's. Yeah, I like them, but they kill my teeth. Oh, uh huh. Full yeah, shot chokes me. down there. That's right. <laughs> Four dildos, as many as you can fit in you. All people. That's it. That's it. That's, That's it. All four of them, buddy. All four of them. Who's that, Paul Peters? That, <laughs> well, well, it's not a clever name. I can assure you that. that, that I probably. I'd like to, probably I'd like to see. Face. I'd like to see that on. A, I'd like to see that on a shirt. <laughs> my name's Paul Peters. <laughs> well, yeah. We're just messing with you, dude. <laughs> yeah. Well, with a picture oh. of a koala, you. He's probably a badass, y'all. We we should probably stop talking. <laughs> We should probably stop talking about his his uh, poor choice of names for our podcast. Hey, four, dild I, hey, four dildos is our name. You better find your own podcast name, dickhead. Oh, it, it is not far off. <laughs> <laughs> oh Lord. Okay, so, right, back to, right. so back to the bathroom thing, real quick. Like, if there was ah. a if there was a porter shitter that was on fire. 
and it was the only bathroom that would be the that would be the toilet that I would use. Okay, so if you went into the bathroom and the only thing left was the urinal, <laughs> I've Why done are it. We talking about this? Why I've, is this a discussion? I've done it. Oh, I've, it's not it's not one of my proudest moments, but I have done it. Okay, oh. let's go a little bit deeper here. Oh. As soon as at Silver Dollar City, they have stalls. So let's say all the stalls were taken. The only thing left is the fucking trough. It's literally a trough down the wall that everybody pees in. No walls hey, or nothing. No, like, look, I've, I've been to stadiums before that had that. Uh, the Pontiac Silver Dome in Michigan, it has one of those trough thingies. And uh, I guarantee, I guarantee that I've probably crapped in it. Oh, good God! Uh, instead Why? of using instead of using those urinal cakes, they just use ice. <laughs> Cold <laughs> piss. Uh, Prime is good. the toilet paper you buy when you don't like your. <laughs> yes, yes. Yeah, you oh. did. You... <laughs> Bruce looks like uh, I as a strip club. Uh, uh, Maybe. <laughs> Interesting. Fred, you like you like cookies, right? Yeah. How about in Japan? They have wasp rice cakes. Wasp rice cake. That, so we're getting into eating bugs. Weird, uh, weird food. Uh, that, the whole episode's right, about food. I've got hey, a million more you know of these. You know there's a whole political party that wants us to stop eating meat and only eat bugs, right? <laughs> but no, Fred, would you try it? Uh, don't know. They they put them in cookies and stuff too. Uh, there, I don't know. Is that is that, that any, is that something like is that something like like in Arizona they have this gas station where you could buy like uh oh, sc scorpion hey. suckers? Yeah, I you buy them in 7 uh 711 when we lived in uh California, they had worms and scorpions. Oh, yeah, and yeah. Kinds of things. Oh, man. man. I, I don't know. I've never tried, like, like actual bugs and stuff. So, I, I don't know, man. I, I'd be on the fence, but I, I'm down to try. I could uh, see that. I could see that. I read that as me tall the way. Yeah, that, that is good. Sounds like a Christmas song. <laughs> me at all. Me at all the way. Uh, what in the world? Hey, uh, Paul Peters. Uh, yeah, you're right. You're right. I do, and I also, I also eat the the spicy chicken wings at strip clubs. All of them, all of the strip clubs, and all of the spicy, uh, spicy wings. So, do you like uh, bones in your wings or no? Hell, not. Well, actually, I take that back. So, <laughs> yes and no. Like for real, for for really spicy, no bones. For like regular yes bones, because you could take one of those bones and like in, put it in your mouth and then like suck the meat right off of it. Take that for what you will, Peter. Peter Paul, Paul <laughs> Peters, Peter Pumpkin Paul, Paul Pumpkin Peter Eaters. Whatever your name is. I'm gonna YouTube. I'm gonna I'm gonna Facebook stalk you for a second, Paul. If we're friends, I'm gonna send you. I'm gonna send you a special little picture. Oh, oh God! What in the world. <laughs> Good God! And like, uh, uh, gotta find the picture of a koala bear. What in the world? Because he is cuddly like a koala bear. This is insane. Oh, I found him. <laughs> okay, we're worrying about the wrong thing here. <laughs> just... Oh, he only has two pictures, but he's a person. He's a real person. Oh Lord, have mercy, guys! I don't. I don't believe. I don't believe he's a real person. <laughs> <laughs> oh Lord, oh, man. Roland, what is your next concept? How come it didn't Ooh. take you that? How come it didn't take you that long to find him? But I can't find him anywhere. I, he's, on, yeah. he's on the SDU Network page. That's where the comments are coming from. I'm trying to find his Facebook page. 
Okay. You're worried about the wrong thing right now. <laughs> about, I'm, not worried. Fun I'm not worried about shit. I'm just saying that if I find him, I'm going to send him a special little picture. Oh, well, I thought, um, <laughs> have you have you all heard about the, the black market cheese? N no. no. Well, uh. Yeah. So all, right, Paul, all right, Paul, we'll get to you later. What's up with this it's, cheese? It's called Kasu Marzu. Never heard of it. And it's uh, it was from Italy. Now, back in the day, only poor people ate it because, yeah, well, they were poor. Um, <clears throat> is that like Americans' government cheese? <laughs> right? No, it's uh, decomposed and occupied by maggots. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, oh now, yuck. it was dangerous to eat and could be fatal. But, of course, within that... The only place you can get it now is on the black market. Most countries outlawed it. Oh, and man, so guys. it's now like a delicacy. Hey, look, uh, loyal followers, if you can find some of this, you should. Uh... Okay. Hey, I'll just give you a heads up. I just banned that guy. Oh, yeah. I appreciate Good. that. Uh, I think you spelled Virginia wrong. <laughs> uh,. Any of all any of all our loyal followers, uh, if you can get your hands on some of this, uh, send us some. Yeah. So okay. So yeah, that that Paul Peter guy, I just I blocked him. I appreciate that. Uh, there's no, no I, point in what he's he, doing. He spelled Virginia wrong though. Yeah, I'm deleting shit. Ah, so, that that's inappropriate. There's no. Oh, reason you're right. You're right. You're right. There's no you're reason. Right. We're just sitting here trying to have fun. Hey, you know. that, that, that profile, like, Roland found it, but it only had two pictures. It sounds to me yeah. like it was a fake profile. Well, probably probably, probably somebody probably somebody that we know uh, with a different profile trying to troll us. Yeah. No congratulations. worries. No worries. Con congratulations, you ogre. Yeah, no worries. No worries. Like I said, I blocked the so, user from that page. So. so would you try something like that? Like, that's... I, like, man, you know, ah, that's weird. Like what kills you, the the cheese or the or the the maggots? I, I I'm guessing the whole thing in general. Because look, like I've eaten I've eaten grubs before. You should be surprised what you eat when you that's all you have to eat and you need protein Ugh. to survive. Ugh. So did that 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 guy's comments just throw everybody off? <laughs> No. no, no, I'm good. Like I, I don't understand. Like I would, I don't, man, I don't. Can I pick the maggots off, or is that part of the? Is that part? No, of I, don't, the, I don't know. I, I, I guess I think it's part of the process. Oh, oh so what about blowfish? I mean, that's uh, no. I would, I, I would try that. I would try that. I like Ooh. live dangerously. Fred, would you try I mean, blowfish? I wouldn't, I, wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't try like gas station blowfish, but oh, okay, okay, we. You know what I'm saying? Talking, all right, we talking about gas station food. Oh, okay. No, no, no. We're talking. We're talking about. We're talking about blowfish. It's like a delicacy. Like oh, the okay. the fish will the fish will kill you. Like it's poisonous. It'll kill you if you don't like if the person cutting it doesn't cut it just right. Okay. Yeah, I, I don't think I would ever. Do that. Well, what if you were like what if you were like 80 years old, man? And like you knew like your time was already coming to an end. So Fred? Yeah, Fred. Which <laughs> What are we talk about like closing time. Yeah, like you know, you're like, I'm gonna go out with a bang. Let me try this. I, I would I, uh, man, skydiving I naked would probably be my preference. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Like if I was like if I was gonna have a heart attack, like if I was old and I knew I was going out, like I'd want to go out like like set my hair on fire and jump out of a perfectly good airplane or something. What the crap? You know what I'm saying? Like I want to do something like crazy, like like when they're like like 50 years from now, they'd be like, "Hey, you remember that guy that did that stupid thing and then died? Yeah, let's not <laughs> do that." Like they they add me to a safety brief and then I live forever. <laughs> Or, or bungee jump. <laughs> no. Now, bungee, Sorry, I was checking to see. Bungee jump uh, could be dangerous, too. 
that. Yeah. So, so Debbie, yeah. Uh, from what I gather, blowfish is like super dangerous for real. Like the, the whole fish, there's only one part of the fish that's edible. And like the, 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 um, the chefs, they train, like, I guess they train their whole life. Uh, whoa, I got some feedback. What's going on? Only one part of the fish that's edible. And, uh, <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> is it still going? No. No, it's good now. Okay. Oh, I know what it was. I had went to the live feed. <laughs> oh, phone, okay. Okay. And Scared I me for a second. My phone is hooked through <laughs> Bluetooth on my little soundboard. Oh, yeah. So, cool, cool. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's so, true, Debbie. Living forever is dangerous. Uh well I mean like living forever is kind of scary but like it's better than being forgotten and like never existing ever again. A uh, fugu puffer fish. Um, he is takes him three years to undergo intensive training right before he is right. licensed to cut a blowfish. Well, I yeah, mean, you got people and, and that, in their in your hand. If, so, that, I mean. if that chef, if that chef like makes one wrong move, he'll get part of the poison on the the edible part, and then you're fucked. So what's Bruce, more you're, intensive? You're, cut, you're cutting in and out pretty bad on my end. Yeah, I got I got shitty signal, y'all. Yeah. I got yeah, I got four. That. I got I got four little uh, little Wi-Fi vampires. Just suckling at the, <laughs> just suckling at the teat of Wi-Fi. Oh, so, yeah, I was looking at some of the bizarre food stuff that that guy used to. Yeah, he had to show bizarre foods. Oh, yeah. he, was, he was in some yeah. third world country. Now that guy will almost eat anything. Um, but the grandfathers would. Uh, Bruce is gone. Yeah, frozen. No, I'm not um, frozen. Oh. Like you were frozen like a mother. You're like, yeah, you're real re- bad pixelated and everything. Um, but anyways, they, they don't circumcise the, the the boys until they're like 10 or 11. And then the grandfathers um, cook it and eat it. Oh, wow. So, okay, so I know that. Okay, so now that we're on that subject. So when my... When, when my... Uh, <laughs> When my oldest son was born, I actually asked the doctor if we could keep the placenta because there's some uh, there's some uh, religious and um, there's some group of people that save the placenta. And on the first the first birthday, they'll cook it and they'll eat it because of all the nutrients and and protein that that comes into the, the placenta. You didn't do that, did you? No, no. The doctor wouldn't let me. My wife wouldn't let me either. But good. Uh, they wouldn't, they also, they also wouldn't let me, they also wouldn't let me bite the umbilical cord. Okay. Bruce, I love you, but I am See, really reconsidering our friendship here. Uh, Bruce, that would be cool though. You're in the middle of the hospital. Like, <laughs> well, that's look, I, I wanted to, but they wouldn't let me. <laughs> what in the crap? I just wanted it to be different, y'all. I just wanted it to be different. Like, okay, like the whole oh, like. Trust e- me, if they're related to you, it's different. No, the the whole eating the placenta that was a joke. But I legit wanted to bite the umbilical cord, and they they refused to let me do it. I Dude, was, that'd be totally cool. I sanitary. was super upset. What? It's just blood, <laughs> right? What do you mean not sanitary? Like it's. It's like been inside of a body. Like it's sanitary enough. No, no, that's horrible. And you should be ashamed of yourself. Well, I'm not. Bad so. Bruce. Bad Bruce. <laughs> Bruce. Bruce eventually is just gonna hate me because I make fun nah. of everything he does. Nah, it's okay. This is the roast episode. Yeah, speaking of the other, speaking the other of day, roast, I walk. I, walk oh, I hate roast. roast. Yeah, same here. What? We just we just talked over you because you're just rambling. No, 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 no. I I heard what you said. And yeah, Russ is horrible, you dude. Now. You are garbage people. That is my favorite thing in the world to make. Dude, you, 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 you make a really do you make a really dry roast? 
Dude, that's what I'm saying, dude. Like, but I can't even oh. eat roast. Like, I've had so much bad roast that I will refuse to well, eat that's roast. Like, that's like that's like turkey for me. Like, everybody's like, "Oh, I love turkey." Yeah, until you get like a piece of dried turkey that you have to literally like massage your throat to get it to go down, and then no. and then all and then all you want for for holiday dinners is ham. <laughs> Because no, you can't, you can't fuck my, my, ro- my roast is the one thing that uh, like Fred, Tab, kids, and everything. Like, Casey gets mad at me if I make a roast and don't call her and tell her so she can come get some of it. That tells you how often David cooks. Bro. Well, like, <laughs> I cook, okay. Hey, I know. I cook a killer roast. Look, like a crock pot roast, that's a little yeah. bit different because yeah. the juices, that's what, the no, juices that's what are. I do. Okay, I do okay. A crock pot roast. Yeah, a crock pot roast, that meat just like falls apart oh, and it's yeah. so moist hey, what i do is i've got my my, my mix and stuff everything i put in there i started at like 10 the night before on low yeah and then when i get up the next morning i put it on keep warm and while i'm at work i have fred go in there and stir it here and yeah. there that shit cooks all day long Hell yeah. But no like I'm saying like Maybe like you are, it's inevitable no. it's inevitable you run uh you you run the risk of at least one time a year running into like the driest roast that you've ever seen in your life. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. it's like I don't like soup either. No, no, for sure, no. But I mean, it's got to be like the meat has got to be like when you you got to be able to oh just tear it and boom. I, li- I like I like soup, but it likes to stay in my beard for too long. I just can't do I will, soup, man. I, it kills my wife. So we got to the point now where I'm like, honey, you cook you soup, I'll find something else. Oh. Yeah, well, oh. no, like she, I don't want her to do that soup because I hate soup. I fucking can't stand soup. Now you get me a chowder, I can do a chowder, a little bit thicker. I don't want to drink my food. Right, thought, right. Like, when I when I do a homemade soup or something like that, I I tend to make it a little bit a thicker soup. Like it's not a chowder, but. I use enough ingredients in it to where you're gonna have some a lot of stuff to eat in this, and it's just gonna be a little bit of liquid. <laughs> well, like I, you want to like the way I like soup is probably the way Roland likes it too. Like if you if you take a cracker and you and you like dip it in, like it needs to the 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 soup needs to be like standing oh, on the cracker. Oh, it needs definitely. to be all, yeah. it's, it needs to be more mine, of a solid than a liquid. Mine's going to be closer to more like a goulash than anything. Mm. You know? Yeah, yeah. I kind of want to. Somebody's like, oh, a tomato soup and grilled cheese. No, no, no. no. Okay, okay. Like tomato soup, milk no. or no? I don't eat tomato soup. Not at all. I, I, I've never had tomato soup, man. You know what tomato soup is? It's a V eight, right? <laughs> <laughs> that's a shoot right there. Yeah, all it is is warm V8. That's that's a good one. Uh, no, I'm not big on like I'll use tomato soup as a base, but I won't not just just straight up tomato soup. Uh, uh-uh, I can't do that. I miss my oh, mom. Oh, what's up, DK? Aww. Oh. <laughs> Is that a sad post? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Uh, bro, like, what you should do is like find her recipe and keep it alive. Yeah, yeah. Well, way to bring the mood down, you peckerhead. <laughs> All right, y'all. How about um, Kahash? What is it? Uh, K H A S H. Kahash. I'm not sure. Yes, it's um. Calfee and cowhead turned into a stew. What? To me, to me, that's like people that eat like hog jaw and pickled pig's feet. Like, no thanks. Like, you know what? Feet. You know what them cows and those pigs like walk around in? I'm sure they're like washed, like in between that time. Oh uh, uh, yeah, oh I'm sure too. <laughs> but you know, like you know, like if you look at a hoof like that. That part in between, <laughs> we are all being blamed. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just, oh, that's like the same thing. I, I know a lot of the uh, old school guys that like the squirrel brains. 
I can't do that. I can't. I just can't do it. Yeah, like I used to go. Like I, I would go squirrel hunting with some friends of mine growing up, and like they're they would they would love that and i'm like no that's gross um yeah but then I, like i went to a grocery store and i think it's only in the south where you can get like scrambled eggs and squirrel brain no oh, thanks yeah. yeah you can order it some places for sure yeah oh, no thanks that's horrible that reminds oh. me of that reminds me of that scene in uh indiana jones where they're like sitting down at that in that palace at the for dinner and like they they whip the the towels off and it's like monkey head. Oh yeah, yeah. Or yeah. or, oh, or when I was or when I was a kid, uh, it's it's been it's been wholly debunked. But when I was a kid, like Faces of Death was a big thing, and yeah. they 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 where oh. they brought that where they brought that monkey in, and then they were that woman was like hitting the monkey in the head with that friggin' hammer. No thanks. Uh, I mean, I'll eat squirrel all day long, but yeah, you ain't getting that. But now this kibosh or kahosh or whatever the hell it is should be illegal. Well, yeah. Where do these? Where do the? Where does this food? Where does this food originate at? Yeah, yeah. That gives a little background. Eastern on. Europe. Eastern Europe. Oh, well, okay, that, that makes they eat no, the garbage of everything. It, it really no, look, If you think about it, it makes a whole lot of sense because over there, there's a lot of cattle farm. Uh, you know, there's a lot of cattle farms in that area, so it would be it would be culturally acceptable to eat every part of the the animal that you could possibly eat. I get that if it, that's your, you know, like you know, wanting to, you know, well, care like you know, that, you know, we started, that, but we, no, we we started this off with haggis. You know, it's it's a traditional. I'll go eat a damn pine cone before I eat the freaking <laughs> cow head. It's it's a traditional Scottish Scottish meal haggis. So, so I mean, over in over in Eastern Europe, you know, that's that's just the that's just the culture. What are you eating on right now? What is that? Jelly swirl. Ah, jelly. Now that, now that is it strawberry jelly. I think so. <laughs> I, oh, my bad. Strawberry jam. <laughs> I don't care. It's good. I hate the I hate the jelly ones, man. Well, it's soft where I can actually bite into it. He even likes the he even likes the jelly filled donuts. You know you know how a gummy bear. I had some I had some lemon. You know how? Oh, you know how, those are horrible. You know, no, you know how, are you rolling? You know how a gummy bear fills those things, right? Okay, that's cool with me. <laughs> But no, uh, jelly-filled jelly anything, dude, is gross. Uh, <clears throat> you're a you're a horrible human being. All right, why? Okay, filled donuts. You get you get two choices: white okay. cream or Bavarian cream. Bavarian. Ooh, Bavarian. Bavarian, Bavarian, Bavarian all day long. All day yes, long. all day every day. Yes, Fred. <clears throat> what? He's gonna say something different because we all said Bavarian. No. Like if you get he like a long, like if you get like a long john, it better have. You want that long cream john cream. to shoot its white cream? <laughs> Dude, what if you can get like a long john half and half? Oh man, uh, why are they I not would, doing that? I would have to, I would have to start with the Bavarian side. And don't get me wrong, like I can, I can stand the 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 white, whatever it is, the white icing or white filling. Yeah, it's kind of more like icing. <clears throat> See, I would take and grab it from both ends and squeeze it. So they push together. Ah, it, it, oh, dude, like these are great ideas for new donuts, man. Hey, if you're listening, the you're very white thing. cream. With... Just, just let everybody know that the four dildos came up with it. God damn it! <laughs> my, no, my favorite kind of donut, though, the old fashioned. Oh yeah, I do. I, I, I love the, the crispiness yeah, of the edge yeah. of the old fashioned donuts. Yeah. Man. Yeah, really is that good. the one where the glaze is just some dude? Be Never mind. Yeah, I love uh, old fashioned. Yeah. I just ruined it, didn't I? Oh, Debbie. Okay. No, I'll still eat it. Some Debbie. It says you got one by your house. Yeah. Okay. Wait, do you live in Hoxie? I guess she does. She says there's one. Because there's over there's her. this place there's this place in town called Midway Donuts, and those dudes, they're awesome. Uh, uh. Excuse me. Poke oh, gosh, okay. Oh, okay. Let me tell you, you what. Be, you shouldn't be poking that harness. That's just bird. Shipley's? 
has the best damn bacon ever. And I'll put anything on that, dude. Shipley's bacon, I don't know what kind it is, but dude, on a scale of one to ten, it's a thousand. I'm not even lying. I I just put that bacon on anything. I just had this crazy idea. Like, if you took like a donut and you put like a strip of bacon on the top of it, like a long john with a piece of bacon inside of it, even. Well, they have bacon donuts. Yeah, they had those. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Well, it's like I didn't know about the freaking cow head soup. Kahash. Kanash. Whatever. That's going to be like a. That's a. That's a mental scar now. Right. Cow right. head, cow head, and foot soup. You gonna be, you gonna be driving by and see old Betsy and be like, oh, there's is, like there's... five of them in the field right yeah, there. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna come home one day. Fred's out there, out there chasing the cow. I'm making soup. Uh, got a, yeah, got a bowl and a ladle. There's a donut place in Conway. They just made a new donut. Yeah. I've, so he's not gonna tell us what it I is. I don't know. Though. I, uh, it's something with caramel in it. I I know that for sure. But okay, so we're talking about weird foods and stuff like that. Head cheese. Oh, 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 oh. so I know how oh, to make head. Look it up. I, I know how to make. I, on it. I know how to make head cheese. We're not the talking re- about what crust around. Never mind. No, the reason I know how to oh, make yeah, head. Yeah, the reason yeah, I know how to make head cheese. Caramel. I worked at a, I worked yeah. I worked at IGA in in Covington, Louisiana, and uh, when I was in high school, and I accidentally stumbled into the meat room when they were making it, and I got like folded in to to helping make it. Oh, it was the worst experience of my life. <laughs> so there's actually another thing like this, and they actually call it um, cow jelly or whatever, and they almost do the cow's head the same way. It's like yeah. a whole cow head, and they almost jelly it. So it's uh, they they make <laughs> they they sell it at Hayes in in town, the grocery store in town. Oh, you can get it in ooh. jars. If we anybody, got like, we got like one viewer right now. If we don't put push everybody away, it's Debbie. She's the she's the stand the standalone. Oh, what, we, what is that? It's only 922. We can't be showing the, that site. I can't show you. It's hard to see. But it's head cheese. Uh, it, uh, looks I, like, I it looks like it looks like lunch meat. Oh yeah, they sell it in they sell it in slices like, oh, get yourself a get Did yourself you some look head up cheese. How it's made, Roland. Uh no, and I, I won't. <laughs> it's a stuff it's a stuff of nightmares, bro. Dude, it's just like uh hot dogs and <laughs> and haggis. Like if you like if you like any kind of like la- like sandwich meat like don't even look don't even like okay who likes liver loaf anybody Dude. oh What's my grandpa about? used to yeah my dad does oh so gross that's horrible even Fred over there making a weird face that's weirder than normal yeah that I know oh god oh. Yeah, I don't even. I, I shouldn't even brought that up. That just killed the room right there. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> Debbie, you're right. Yeah, what's crazy is we ain't even got other than Debbie. We ain't got a whole lot of our regulars watching yeah. tonight. If everybody else had something better to do, they're like, "Screw these idiots." Uh, it's Thursday night. The only thing to do is watch Special Dummies Unit. I mean, dude, four dildos. Right. Listen, they're learning. They would be learning a lot about different foods right now. And hearing music in the background. It's true. Oh, yeah, I got one more. Ooh. It's the uh, Hackerel Shark. So you know, what you they did, do, Bruce, you just commented that on all of I our know, stuff, right? I know. You're a dumbass. Anyway, I'm, go look, ahead. I'm saving it per, per, for perpetuity. Uh, um... So what they do, they hang uh, sharks from the rafters for about five to six months. And uh, after the time that it sits to ferment, it will actually be okay to eat without having to be cooked. Wow. Is this like in Japan or something? Uh, No. Dude, that's like, that's like when you... Uh... 
That's like when you like dry cure uh, meat. Or what is that like when you when you like cure meat in like a no, well, it's not like a dehydrator, but like you take like a whole leg of like some animal and you like. Well, it's an some... aging process. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like age curing and like. Okay, then... where where does this originate? <clears throat> ah, it's the national dish of Iceland. Huh. It's oh, hung and dry oh. for five months. It has a strong ammonia and uh, rich smell and fishy taste. I hope it tastes so like it's, fish. It's fish. So it's very briny. Dude, I would not eat it. <clears throat> you can buy you can buy packets of it. Oh wow! But they oh, actually sell them in stores, dude. <laughs> those hey, those new to it may <laughs> gag involuntarily at the first attempt to eat it. Wow! <laughs> so like everybody, like even even kids, like when they first eat it, they're like, ugh. Yeah, I guess it has such a strong wow. ammonia. <laughs> Can you imagine like being born in Iceland and then them them putting like a bowl of like rancid shark meat in front of you? Like, here you go. This and is that, for you. And now that is that what they sound like in Iceland? <laughs> no, that that's that explains why Tab is scared of sharks now. <laughs> no, no, like like the Swedish chef, like burndy ferndy. <laughs> I was thinking more of like a Leif Erikson, like here you go, here's your, uh, here's your, your rotted shark, eat up. Oh, I'm a like the kid is like, oh, this is gonna be great, and then they put it in their mouth and they're like, Ugh. what did you do to me? Like, is it better the second time? Do you only do that one time? What the crap, dude? What? That's like that Ricky Gervais uh, comedy skit when he was talking about trying dick. <laughs> <laughs> you had to listen to it, dude. It's hilarious. He's like, you can't. He's like, don't just try it. Like, maybe you won't like it the first time, but just keep trying. Yeah, just keep trying it until you like it. Like, <sighs> oh my god. What oh you man. <laughs> Hey, we might we might talk about food. You never know. Oh, good God! <laughs> hey, can, can we talk? Can we stop talking about foods we won't eat? <laughs> Let's talk about food we gonna eat. Okay. <laughs> like, like what, Fred? <laughs> Any... <laughs> Ramen how noodles about... without the water in the microwave. <laughs> no, 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 no. How about Speak... how about eggs? Eggs on a cheeseburger. Eggs on cheese. Yeah, yeah. yeah eat, like it's yeah. like a sunny side up egg. Yeah, I. I had one the other day. We went in Russellville. Yeah, the brunch brunch Ooh, burger. It was good. Yeah, we went over to Peg Leg. I yeah, like the I like good. the idea. I like the idea of like, if it's got an egg in it, you cut it and then the yolk like pours all over the the burger. Only thing I have a hard time with those is because you know. Oh, dude! Yolk, beard. yolk in the beard is the worst. I think that's why the other, uh, last Saturday when I took my beard and like messed with Hunter, he's like, "Oh, your beard smells good." And all I can smell is like the leftover bacon grease <laughs> yeah, from yeah. the cheeseburger I ate a while earlier. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, it smells like bacon. I mean, eggs—you can eat eggs any kind of way. Yeah, you can, but Fred, ninety-nine percent of the time, scramble with cheese. Dude, yeah, you know what? Right. I I can't I can't do anything but. Um, scrambled eggs, man, because I was yeah. scarred a long time ago. <laughs> really? With egg. Yeah. Listen, I do not like um, the egg whites. Oh, like, really? I want them cooked. Like, I love the yolk, but I don't want the egg whites runny. So, I want. My oh, eggs. yeah. I know what I you're want, saying. I want my <clears throat> eggs over medium. Like, and like you so, get them, like you get them sunny side up, and like the the yolk or the 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 white, the white the egg too. white is is yeah. kind of runny and like soup. Yeah. And so I was young and I didn't know and I bit into it. And I was like, this egg is still fucking raw. <laughs> yeah. So and, it's almost like a so it's almost like you're eating a jellyfish. Yeah, but with like a a, a yellow inside. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, I I typically go over medium. Uh I'd rather it be a little overcooked than undercooked though. Uh, I, I'm not big on the whites being any kind of runny. That's why I usually di tab cooks it because she knows how to actually do an actual over medium. 
Yeah, the maybe, why, maybe why you keep talking about ice cream? She's talking about ice cream, dude. I love ice she cream. Stole, she stole her husband's bowl, guys. Vanilla. Dude, what's bean. your favorite? What's what's your favorite ice cream? Me, Debbie. Who? Yeah, anybody. Go, yeah, everybody. Uh, <clears throat> vanilla. Uh, oh, just you're so uh, <laughs> okay, no, 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 no. Okay, so <clears throat> absolute favorite orange sherbet. That's not ice cream. <clears throat> Yeah, okay, technically, well, then, technically it's not, but no, no, you're butter, right, you're right. It's a, it's a sherbet. Mine's is butter pecan. Yeah, butter pecan. Oh. Oh. I like butter pecan. Fred, Fred, Fred got some this last go round. Yeah, uh, some banana pudding it ice cream. Good. Hell yeah, it's really, really, really freaking good. Oh, yeah. Okay, so uh, y'all guys know, y'all guys know my my utter disdain oh, for like green. like a lot of regular like chocolate stuff. Uh, my dad, he lives in Russellville. He came, he came down, uh, uh, and or yesterday, I think it was, and he brought me a bag of chocolate banana nut muffins. Ooh. They were absolutely delicious. You know, like when you when you get a, a banana muffin, banana nut muffin, and like before you actually like right past your, man, that, you are just, cutting out bad, dude. Damn, yeah, my simple yeah. shit, guys. <clears throat> Just fine. So, Just give it a second to buffer. I don't know how. Yeah, it's wow. like we're here. Oh, I love that. Oh. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, what? Do you guys like dark chocolate, milk chocolate, or what? Milk chocolate. Bruce just said he don't like chocolate. <laughs> no, I, I know, know, but if I if I had to choose dark chocolate. See, like, uh, I hate dark chocolate, man. It's too rich. I don't like, like I could dark probably, chocolate either. I could probably use it for like cooking, maybe. But yeah, yeah, I'd rather have milk chocolate. Oh my knee! Oh, oh yeah! Oh, God. <laughs> I'm achy. My knees are achy. Dude, I'm telling you, my my left knee is getting, turning into liquid shit. Uh, mine is too. I, I actually oh. had to get the brace that actually has the bars on the side now. I went uh, golfing today and my ACL was like, Help me! <laughs> Bruce, Bruce, serious oh. question. Let's serious see what question. It is. What's up? Hot <clears throat> chocolate, yes or no? Ooh. Yes. What? Yes. Yes? Okay, you're cut. You're still cutting yeah. it out yeah, dude. really bad. Hey, so like you know, like the signal where it's got like the little like diamond, and then it's got like the two lines. Like, eh, uh, I'm, eh, just, uh. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just at the diamond. <laughs> it's bad that mine is working better than anybody's. This is horrible. Um, I'm about to, I'm about to throw on some, I'm about to throw on some freaking hot spot over here. Why I got blazing, I, like I got white. blazing fast internet on on uh on uh, my hot spot, but. Uh. I like white chocolate, hot chocolate. That's actually really good. That's really good. Thank you. Oh. With yes, mini, mini marshmallows. Um, so mini marshmallows. Oh, okay. Marshmallows. Who likes the? <laughs> okay, so like around Halloween, around Halloween, around Halloween, they come out with the the white chocolate like Snickers and the white chocolate cups. Uh, yeah. yeah. Those are my absolute favorite. Like, if I had to, if I had to choose between like the white chocolate, and the white chocolate are. Bang, 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 bang. I think you say you would choose between the white chocolate and the regular chocolate. Hershey Reese's thing. He's, he's choosing the white chocolate. <laughs> All right. And I'm not eating no peanut butter. Yeah. None. That's that's unfortunate, man. Yeah, yeah that's not the way they want to die. I thought about <laughs> right, right. peanut. How about sneaking some peanut butter and something to give it to? Here you go. Let's see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just th I just thought about I just thought about a uh, casual murder. <laughs> no big deal. <laughs> no, I, like, I never thought the same thing. If I was like, I wonder if I put some shrimp in this. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I, didn't see that. I knew that everything would swell up, so I'd actually look like I got a big. Never mind. Hey, what's, what's, know, a little, thinking, what's a little anaphylactic shock between friends? Yeah, I mean, it's no big Dude, we go out Romeo and Juliet style. 
<laughs> Except for less boning. Oh, maybe. Maybe. Oh. <laughs> if everything swells, you can't let it go to waste. All right. <laughs> uh, Debbie, Roland is allergic to peanut butter. That's where it is. We kind of glitched out for a second there. So. Yeah. Yeah, he's got a shellfish allergy. Yes, I'm allergic to crawfish he's got and a, shrimp. He's got I'll go a, past that. He, I never tried. On the nightstand, he's got a little tub of uh, shellfish cream that he uses. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I know. I took him and, and put the peanut butter. <laughs> and an EpiPen. <laughs> Why has this peanut butter got a small hole in the middle of it? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, dude, that reminds me of that. That reminds me of that that video on on TikTok or Instagram where the dude the dude's like, "You want some peanut butter?" And he's like, "Yeah, I have some peanut butter." And he opens the jar. His friend opens the jar, and there's a hole in the center of it. <laughs> <laughs> he just oh, puts a Lord. he just puts a lid on it and hands it back like, "No thanks, bro." <laughs> wow. Oh man! Well, and it works out with my shellfish allergy because my wife doesn't like seafood at all, so we don't worry about it. And fuck Fred, you know, so he doesn't matter. Uh, so, well, I bet oh, you, so, I bet so you surfing, you say, I bet you surfing so you turf night is shit. <laughs> so that just a lot of just a lot of turf. Yeah, a lot of turf, a lot of. So, yeah. so what he's saying is, I gotta be uh, three tables away from them if I eat seafood. No, no, <laughs> no. You can eat seafood, but you just got to pay for it, and that'll see you wanting to do that. <laughs> right, yeah, right. Expensive. Hey, I, I, I always. Have now, as long as that, like, you ain't getting it all over your hands and trying to touch my face and shit, I'm fine. But, you know. No, that's what I meant. Like, like beside the bed, there's a little jar of like crab cream and an epipen. And and the reason it's by the the reason it's by the nightstand is so you know things swell up and then the epipen is to make I, it go I was down. Talk about Fred eating at the restaurant with. Oh hey, oh, I, I was thought, sure. I, I, I was I was all the way weird. in left field. I thought about trying something weird like a, uh, a hamburger, like cheeseburger, and then put shrimps on it. But I was like. I'm sure like shrimp bread. wouldn't be bad. Oh, like like the butterfly shrimp, like when they like yeah, flat, like the when they the flatten them out. Yeah, I'm sure somebody's done that somewhere. Oh, my, yeah, I mean you can order like seafood burgers. Oh, they have like oh, little really? seaweed on them and stuff. Oh. oh. Okay. Have any of y'all ever ate like the like the seaweed? Yeah, yeah. Flat like the little seaweed <clears throat> cheese. Yeah. Uh, when I was in the when I was in the Eighth, seventh, or eighth grade. My uh, our our biology teacher had went on summer break, and when he came back, he he had went to Japan, and he brought back some like Japanese snacks, and there were like these yeah. little strips of little strips of seaweed. That's actually the, almost identical to the only time I ever ate it. <laughs> oh, uh, interesting fun fact: it was in Paris, Arkansas, at Paris High School. That wasn't very ah, fun. I went to Paris. So- for a little bit. Right. Being in Arkansas is the only time you can say, I've been to Paris, London, and England. <laughs> and Nash to- and Nashville, but that's another that's another story entirely. Experience England. Just see what it feels like out there. It sucks. Oh. I don't know. <laughs> I wanna I wanna go one day. Just All right, England, how about you? Would England, you Arkansas is kind of garbage. Uh, from the country of Nambia in South Africa, their food of choice is warthog anus. Oh wow! What? Is it, do you fry it like onion rings? Yeah, I, no, it's like a whole anus, dude. Like it's a whole anus. Oh wow! Inside now. <laughs> What did you eat for dinner? What you eat for dinner last night? I had Pumbaa's butthole. <laughs> I ate ass. <laughs> <laughs> that that that's a whole that, that gives a whole new meaning to eating the booty like groceries. <laughs> I gotta pee. <laughs> so do I. I but I'm pee. so do I, but I'm being a man and I'm holding it. 
Oh, I heard dude, this, dude, it looks <laughs> gross. It looks gross. You need to Google it. Oh my gosh. Okay. Hey, go I to images. Want, I don't want to. What's it called? It's uh, just put Nambia warthog anus. <laughs> you're done. <laughs> Debbie said you're done. <laughs> oh, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> I, I, could no. You eat? I know. Could you oh. eat that? That's, hey, uh, that's exactly, that's exactly what I thought it would look like. <laughs> hey, hey, get that off of that screen. We're gonna get, we're gonna get, we're gonna get flagged for nudity. <laughs> we're not. Uh, uh, yeah. Hey, you know it. I had it'd be different. Really it'd be different. I, it'd be different if it was like chopped up and looked like that. Right? Like if you didn't tell me and just put that in front of me, I would try it. Right. And the second, and the second that they told us what it was, it'd be over. It'd be a fist. It'd be fist fight music. I would be mad about many things, but I think I would be pissed off about that one. <laughs> oh, yeah, dude, absolutely. Tab, tab come home, make some of that for me. She's like, so you remember how you said you never eat ass? I'll be right back. <laughs> oh, oh, what? Man, what? Gotta go. I got to go get some water. Man, go Everybody just leave us be. We're the boring right, Fred one. has to talk. Yeah. Talk, Fred. Ah, don't make fun of the way I get up. Poor baby Jesus. <laughs> I <can't move. laughs> I'm stuck. Fuck you, Fred. You I, didn't say that. I didn't even say anything. Why are you like... Roland is grounded. <laughs> yep, Roland is grounded. <coughs> oh. Good yep. God. This has been a very interesting episode, to say the <laughs> least. Uh... Excuse yeah. me. Straight up. That's all you got is just straight up? Straight up in the hood. Well, don't even try that crap. Good God. Ain't that right, ain't that, ain't that right Boo? Straight up What's in that? the hood. Straight up in the hood. What the hell are you listening to? Uh, this is the Spice Girls, y'all. Oh, God. Uh, late nineties, late nineties, early two thousand, nostalgia, baby. Yeah, that's why it's nostalgic. It just stay there. <laughs> your wife is fired. <laughs> David says you're fired. <clears throat> She's gonna get our YouTube video blocked for copyright infringement. For right, like right. You're gonna get our YouTube music. video blocked for copyright infringement. <laughs> Uh, apparently, Bruce is canceled. How did and, I get can Bruce is canceled for tonight? Roland is, gra is grounded. <laughs> I'm can I'm canceled because I Googled it and showed everybody. Bruce, oh, where did the you, warthog where did, hole? Bruce, oh, why, yeah, where, did, where did you go? I had to go pee. Because you're oh, fucking winded. Oh. Like, you should not be winded from that. Like, <laughs> I'm, I'm not winded. <laughs> Dude. I'm not winded. <laughs> he naturally breathes heavy as hell. Yeah, uh, dude, you know, it's, it's that, ASMR. He got that hair covering him up, so he's constantly out of breath. It's it's ASMR. Now, could now you're in bed with Bruce. <clears throat> so anyway, <laughs> uh -huh. now nobody can hear me. Uh, we heard you sound like a little oh. girl there. So. <laughs> Oh, hey, did y'all see? Um, you ever see the? There's uh, some countries do it. It's a uh, uh, an egg that's cooked, hard boiled, with the chicken still inside, or the bird. Oh wow! Uh, that uh... I mean, basically they're cooking a fertilized egg. Yeah, I mean, mm-hmm. Uh, that's horrible. I mean, I know it's pretty much the same damn thing, but it's still just like Ugh. it's like a step up. They're like, yeah, you know, yeah. let's see. How. It was like I don't, I don't want regular scrambled eggs, but I also don't want fried chicken right now. Where do I go? <laughs> okay. 
Hey. Bruce, what are you looking at? I'm, I Googled weird hey. foods from around the world. I think I'm on the site that I mean, I think I'm on the site that you were on. Uh, so uh, there was a movie that came out when I was uh, a young, a young whippersnapper, and in the movie, uh, all the eggs that they that they cooked had a had a a, a chicken fetus in it, and like that thing scare that scares me. That's why I will not I eat know what, fresh I eggs. I can't remember the name of it, but I, I know what movie you're talking. I know you're, what you're talking about. Yeah, I'll, I'll never eat farm fresh eggs. Like I got, <laughs> I got a lot of, I got a lot of family members that are like, "Hey, I uh, got some eggs because I, I raise chickens. Uh, uh, if you want a couple of dozen, just come by the house." And I'm like, "Uh, that's like telling me, hey, I got some poison over here. Uh, <laughs> if you'd like some, if you'd like some, come visit." <clears throat> Lord have mercy. No thanks. <laughs> oh, I don't think it's what the baby kid into rolling. I think it's just like weird food. It's like it's like the first guy that like found out that you could drink milk from a cow. Like how many udders did this oh, guy <clears throat> how many udders did this guy suck from before he realized <laughs> that cow milk was how delicious? Many, how many cows did he suck off before he realized you <laughs> had to find the udder? <laughs> oh, it's that's that utterly kind of disgusting. That's utterly disgusting. Uh, uh, uh. I'm an in in interesting individual. Fred, would you ever eat black pudding? Black pudding? I have. It's I, good stuff. Have you? Yeah. I, I know. I've I've heard of it. I've never tried it. I know it's kind of like gross ingredient. So it's like yeah, it's I, like it's like blood sausage. It is. It's uh, pig's blood and oatmeal, and it's uh, oh. put in a like a a skin, you know, like they would make sausage. Oh, oh, no. oh. And it's got like some gelatin in it. Listen, I want to know who fucking <laughs> thought of this stuff. Like, right? right. Hey, uh, yeah, we got people? we got we got all this pig's blood and oatmeal. Um. We need to be put together. Let's put it in a sausage skin and put it on a bun. <laughs> <laughs> like, dude. like they oh, had, man. this was way before the internet when they didn't, you know, couldn't just look up saying things were gross. Oh, almond milk? Yeah, I heard almond oh, milk. Oh, almond milk's almond great. Milk. Almond milk would be all right. I'm just trying to figure out where they get the titties at on there to milk it. Yeah. Almonds don't have titties, they have balls. So just you fill in the blanks. <laughs> it's almond. It's nut it, it, it is. It it's is nut nut. nut. It's nut it nut. nut, nut. <laughs> anyway, back to reality. You like my new hat? Yeah, I love it. Yeah, yeah, that's super hey, do you cool. Guys, do you guys like blue cheese? No, not no. Really. Uh, -uh. uh, I made the mistake. I'm allergic to it. I made a mistake of getting that on a Caesar salad one time. By accident. Yeah, I can't, I can't do it. Uh -uh. <laughs> yeah, it's totally by accident. But you know they do uh, blue cheese with um, chicken wings. Yeah, which is yeah, weird. I, I just with Tad being allergic to it, I, I really haven't even tried. All right, we're talking. Years. We're talking about milk. Uh, what about buttermilk? If oh, cooking, like by itself? Good no. or gross? Oh, no. Oh, no. that shit's horrible. If, if you you just drinking it. Oh, dude, no. my dad. My dad likes buttermilk and crackers. Dude, well, my grandpa dad, used to do your dad too, man. Like a horrible person. <laughs> oh. uh, uh, he's got a he's got a horrible taste of foods. Oh. dude, it's got to be an old thing, dude. Like, it's got to be yeah, an old person thing. It had to be their upbringing and what they had yeah. available. My, right, my grandma, right. my grandma, drank it like crazy. I, I we'll use it for cook, like when we do fried chicken or something. We'll use it. You know, in the batter and whatnot, but yeah, outside of that, no. Oh no! What about candy why, corn? Yeah, is that? I told you guys I'm weird. I like the. I like the. Oh, hold, the on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Are you bringing it up because you know I can't eat it? Look at no, just, I don't think just, of things to just fuck with you, David. David. Like David, you do, David. David, just put it in your mouth until it gets soft. That's not the first time you've said that to me. 
Oh, no, this is great. Candy, candy, candy corn don't bother me. I mean, I don't think it's gross like a lot of people do. But, I mean, it's not something that, like, I'll go out and buy on purpose. But if we have some, I might munch on it. Right. Yes, yes. dude. Guess Mexican, what I just found? Mexican what? street corn. I just found a freaking ramen burger. A ramen, a ramen burger? Is, it the, is the buns ramen? Yes, it's fried ramen noodle bun. Wow. Argula, which is like a weird. Oh, arugula. Yeah. Beef patty, uh, soy sauce, scallions, and the other fried ramen noodle patty. Dude, dude, you go over to Japan, they take their ramen seriously. Oh, no joke, dude. Uh, uh, that doesn't I follow, surprise me. I, I follow a guy on YouTube that, like, he's an American, but he lives in Japan. He's got his Japanese citizenship. And that dude does uh, ramen noodle uh, reviews all the time. <clears throat> and dude, like some of the some of the ramen bars that they have over there, are just crazy. Oh, it's Michael Bolton. Uh, <laughs> well, I think that's a good time to end the show. Uh, 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 Michael Bolton. <laughs> 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 Well, I do believe, though, it is, this is a good stopping point because it's almost 10 o'clock. I feel like it, this is a good place to kick it off because I am sleepy as hell. So, <laughs> Well, it's because, you, it's because you took a half nap. Yeah, dude. You didn't take like, didn't a take, full 30 minute was, nap? Or? It, it, was, it, was, it was an hour and a half. So you oh, napped for two that long. Half. That half, yeah, you had nap for too long, and now you're just tired. You're like walking I just, tired. I, I don't sleep much anymore. That's like the most sleep I get most of the time is when I take my nap after work with Tab before she goes to work. Then I right. go go I go in there and lay in my bed and lay there and stare at the ceiling until about three in the morning. Got to get up at five. So but, anyway. <laughs> All right. <laughs> what? What? Sleep is for the dead. Rolling. Yo. Throw us, some, throw us some last thoughts. All right, y'all. Those who scared what person? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got we got we got we got four people watching now. Oh, cool. Just never be afraid to venture <clears throat> and try new things. If you don't know what you like and what you right. Know. Really good. Boom. That was really good. Bruce. Hey, uh, I'm going to I'm going to mirror what he said. You only live once. Uh enjoy it. Okay. Frederick. Oh, okay. Well, like 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 they say, don't don't be afraid to go anywhere and try a new thing. Peace out. Okay, and I will end this with saying don't be Fred. Have a good night.